What's going on everybody? It's your boy Galloman20. Welcome back to another tutorial and in this tutorial we are going to be installing Lenny's Mod Loader and Police Tape. You have to install Lenny's Mod Loader in order to install Police Tape and also if we get this video to 1000 likes or if we reach 100 members before we reach 1000 likes then I will do 100 push-ups on a live stream and also if you need help with this tutorial everything will be down in the description step by step labeled one through whatever how many steps we have to do and every link will be provided for you and don't forget to smash the like button so let's get started so you're gonna have to click the first link which is Lenny's mod loader download it to your desktop and then you're gonna see this right here LML beta 01 you're gonna right click on it you're gonna extract it to your desktop and then you're going to get this folder right here this you can just delete you don't need it anymore you're just going to need Lenny's my letter beta 1 so you're going to see two files here you're going to see a license and then a readme as well below so you're going to take the mod manager folder and you're going to put it on your desktop now of course I have my mod manager file right here I did not delete it so that's what you're going to do I'm just going to delete it here so you guys see that I put it on my desktop going to go to this you're going to go to mod loader you're going to open up your grand theft auto 5 directory do is you're going to go and take everything here so you're going to click on one you're going to hold shift you're going to go down and then you're going to hold control and then you're going to toggle that one off so you're going to place all these files in your main gta 5 directory so you're just going to drag and drop it right like that it should all be in there and you should be good to go so after that you can close out of that file and what you're going to do is you're going to open up mod manager the thing that you put on your desktop you can place mod manager anywhere you want i place mine on my desktop you can place it in your grand theft auto 5 directory you can place it anywhere just remember where it is so next step you're going to go ahead and click on mod manager.ui from there it's going to bring up lenny's mod loader beta 1 you can exit out of mod manager and then you're going to see all this stuff right here so this just shows what mods are listed what mods are downloaded and installed you got different settings you can change the color of the background everything like that very very cool also tells you if your game is running or not finding all that stuff so what you're going to do you're now going to click on that next link that takes you to police tape mod and what you're going to do you're going to keep Lenny's Mod Loader beta open, the launcher itself, and what you're going to do is click on download with Mod Manager. And then you're going to click agree and download. And then what it's going to do is going to count down, count down, and after that, it's going to go right inside of here once it is done downloading. Okay, now since the mod has been successfully installed in Lenny's Mod Loader, you should see it police tape installed, and then you should also see it in this directory right here. Okay, you can officially exit out of Lenny's Mod Loader for right now, and then you're going to go to your Grand Theft Auto 5 directory and go under the LML folder. You're going to go inside and go to Downloader, Police Tape, and you're going to go to the GTA 5 folder. Then you're going to see Rage Native UI Parks Tools PDB and then Parks Tools DLL with the plugins folder. So what you're going to do is you're going to take these files, you're going to copy them, and then you're going to go back to your Grand Theft Auto 5 directory and you're going to paste it. What it's going to do is it's going to add a police tape folder with the police tape uh, files right here and then everything else should be good to go after that's done you are good to go police tape is set up make sure you have rage plugin hook installed or else you will not be able to use police tape that's another thing that i forgot to mention if you guys don't have rage plugin hook installed you have to install that before you install any of these modifications to grand theft auto 5. once you guys completed this tutorial and you guys got to the very end of it wait two hours and this video should be live where I show you how to use 
police tape and also how to place the evidence markers on the ground in GTA 5. So I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. I hope this was very helpful to you guys and I will see you guys in the next one. I'm out of here. Peace.